Hi all and welcome to my channel. This is Shannon with Seven Shannon. Now you all know today I got a Dollar Tree haul. Yes, I went to the tree. The tree is for me. No, um, I went to the tree and I only spent uh, $53. So that's a good thing. I'm saving up for washer and dryer. So I'm like, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? I got to like chill out on my money flow. But I did buy some good things, some things that I did need. Now remember, everything I buy, I use. I um, sometimes I donate if I have too much, or I give it to give it. You know, I give it to family members. But yeah, so let's get into this haul. In this haul, all right. This is a mishmash of products. I did not separate them in categories because guess what? I'm busy today. I got um, my washing machine guy coming to take out the old one. Get it up out my house, you know, I heard. All right, let's go. First, I got these um, Good Sense Drawstring. Five large trash bags. Yes, large. These are the big black ones with the red strings. They're 30 gallon. I brought these because I am donating to the Epilepsy Foundation. Out here, they do come and pick up. And I have that to my heart because when my little Joey was little, he used to have seizures. And that's considered epilepsy. He doesn't have them anymore, but when he was a baby, he, used to, he had them for a while. And, um, yeah, so that little program is there to my heart. So I will be donating Dollar Tree stuff and what I have in my basement, Christmas, clothes, whatevs, get a, all right. So the next thing is I needed a light bulb. So I saw the sunbeam warm white, not a soft white, probably the same thing. I don't know. LED floodlight, um, right in a 650. It's just a floodlight to put on my floor lamp. So I am going to put it on there because I my I really need my living room lit really well because I don't have a lamp or a, um, well actually I just brought a lamp. Oh, uh, duh. No, I don't have like a, um, nothing on my ceiling like a, you know, like a light in there. So yeah, so I got this for that. Okay, and then I got these, which was a really good find. These are the Bubble Mail Mailers by Jot. And these are two packs of Bubble Mailers. And I like these because you can mail books in them. And I'm going to mail these to three of my favorite haulers. I have three things for them. So I'm really excited to send them my little find. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. And then after that one, I got good old rental foil sheets. Always buy these. Yes, these are the best. You put your little, we can put a sandwich in there. You could put, um, what else can you put in there? Anything small, I mean, I mean, they, they cover a baking sheet, a little baking sheet. So they're really cool because you just rip one off and you use it. Love it, love it, love it. All right, and then I got, um, of course, you all know I got my Wizards, right? I got, these are both repurchases. They haven't come out with any new Wizards. I'm pissed. Dollar Tree, come on now. Step up your game. Come out with new Wizards. I got the Wizard Morning Mist. I'll spray it and schmidt it. <sighs> God, these things, man, I'm telling you. God. Oh, my Lord. <sighs> I love it. Love it. it. Smells like a bouquet of flowers. The morning mist and then the fresh vanilla. Probably smells like vanilla, but let's see. <sighs> see how it flows? <sighs> it doesn't flow in a straight mist. It flows like an air. It's awesome. These, oh, my God, the vanilla. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Love it. All right. And then I got... This spray bottle, okay? It's a big peach spray bottle. It's beautiful. I put my cleaner, my refill cleaners that I buy, my Fabuloso, my, um, everything I put in here to spray. I don't use it for water. I use it for an extra bottle, like a, like a bottle, like spick and span I put in here. And I just spray. Yeah, and it's refillable. So it's awesome. Yeah, it saves you a lot of money. For a buck, you're saving money. Then I got... This foam mounting tape by Super Glue. This stuff is amazing. If you do not cannot put screws in your walls, get this stuff. It's called foam mounting glue tape. This stuff is amazing. As you can see, all my pictures up here. I don't know if you can see them. They are all hung up with this. Everything in my house is hung up with these because I cannot get a screw to my wall for some reason. I don't know why. And that's that back. So we're gonna get into this one. This is a movie. Um I brought it because James Purefoy was in it, and um, it's Frankenstein. And I guess it's um, it's a gripping retelling of Mary Shelley's got the classic Frankenstein. So yeah, I like Frankenstein. And I thought it was pretty cool. 
just to have the movie. I don't have it. I love my scary movies. Y'all know that. Alright, and then I got these, which I have to throw away because they've been sitting out. I don't know. I'll probably try to keep them. Because they're just um, vegetables. They are by Jennifer's Garden. Traditional vegetable spring rolls. As little as two minutes. Quick and easy. You get ten of them. They're 55 calories per roll. And I've been eating these lately to try to watch what I eat. And they're really, really good. They're just called spring rolls. Guys, I buy these all the time. I could catch them. I caught them in Arizona, which is good because I ate them. All right, and then I got um some pudding, some pudding. I got the butterscotch snack pack pudding. Uh-oh, turn it around. These are good. I know my grandma used to eat these, and people tell me, you're only 45, why do you eat butterscotch pudding? I said, uh, because it's good. Duh, bomb. I'm telling you, not trash at all. And then I got, um... Some cream of weedy. This is another repurchase. This is a cream of weed three pack with cinnamon flavor, cinnamon and sugar. Makes your mouth want to melt. Look at how good that looks. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm all in. All right. And then I got um repurchase again. Repurchase. This is a do one better popcorners, a crunchy and wholesome popcorn snack. White cheddar. I love them. Love them. Love them. This is a three ounce bag. I'm telling you, these are the bomb. Love them. They're so good. They taste like popcorn in a chip, like Doritos in a chip. And then I got my shorty, my Michael. I got him um these chocolate vanilla snack packs because he loves chocolate vanilla. So yeah, um, I um he likes some. He doesn't like the butterscotch. He's like, oh my nasty. So then I got um. This chili with no beans by Hartford House. Never heard of Hartford House, but I love chili with no beans. So I got two cans of these. So I can make my chili bake or my chili mac. So I got that. Put that up there. So I'm trying to organize it out here because my living room is a mess, guys. I got so many orders. It's crazy. Then I got, I need a ranch dressing and I wanted just a little one because I'm the only one that eats it. So I got the wishbone ranch dressing. And there's wishbone. There's a small bottle, though. It don't. It only is um eight fluid ounces, but I like it because it's very compact. And I'm the only one that eats it, so it's all good for me. I don't have to buy that big old stupid bottle. And then I got this stuff, guys. Oh my god, it's amazing. It's like ketchup and mustard and something else. It's like a mixture of all that. It is so good. This is the Heinz 57 sauce. Add zest and chicken, steak and pork. Oh my god, if you like ketchup and mustard, fire. Fire, put this on your cheeseburger. Oh my god, guys, I'm, I'm telling you, I am telling you. Heinz 57 sauce, yes. All right, and um, okay, let's finish this bag up. Well, I'm out of books. All right, let's get in some, um, um, I got these good old Tums. These are the antacids. I have heard real bad, as you know, in my videos. I talk about it all the time. And after you get 60 of them, I always keep these in the house because you never know when you're going to need them. Okay, I must, might be two hauls, guys, because I do have a lot of stuff. All right, and then I got this, guys, this Yardley. Oh, my God, Yardley of London. Now, you guys know Yardley of London, London is a nice, expensive soap. This is a moisturizing body bar in English lavender. Yeah. And you could smell it through the box. I love lavender, freesia. I love all them, all them smells. Especially lavender. It smells amazing. So I grabbed two. I said, I'm grabbing them bad boys. For a dollar a piece. Regardly. Oh my Jesus. Alright, and then I got um this LED flashlight. I saw a lot of haulers hauling it. It's just a little flashlight that um goes on both things. It's like a little, um I don't know. It looks like that. I'm not going to sit there and check it out. It looks like that. It looks like a little lantern, which is cool. And it's red. And I guess it lights up on here and here. I thought it was really cool. So I got that. Okay, I'm trying to keep everything intact. And then from April, bath and shower, I got two things, which I never buy from them. I got this um, body lotion with blackberry and lilac scented. These were the last ones, and I will smell it. Come out pretty nice, see? Well, come on now. 
Yeah, I smell that one pretty good. I just use it to moisturize my body. And then, of course, I got the musk and freesia scented. Every time I see the purple on any product, I get excited because I know it's either freesia or lavender. Oh, yeah. Smells really, really good. Yes, sir. Got them for a dollar. Dollar make you holla, holla, holla. And then for my art class, I did pick up um some supplies by Jot. Okay, I got these Jot permanent markers, 8-pack. And you get the assorted colors, the stupid glare guys. You get yellow, orange, blue, and then blah, 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 blah. But yeah, they're permanent, so I got them. And then I got the Jot 48 crayons. I need these for my art class, so I hope these crayons work pretty good. I mean, I know they're bogus Dollar Tree crayons, but come on, I'm 45. I don't need no richy-ass crayons. All right, and the last thing in this bag are these guys. These were fire. I thought they were so cute. These are just the earbuds by East circuit Look at that. It's like a tie-dye, guys. That is so cool. That's why I brought them. They probably don't work. They're probably trash, but I love the color. You know, y'all dig. Jerry Garcia. All right, so then I got to go to this bag. It's probably going to be my last bag because I have a lot more. Well, you know what? I don't know. On timing. Let me see what we're doing on timing. Okay, we're all right. I got the Palm Olive Essential Clean. 25% more free. This stuff is really good. It's the best dish soap you can buy at the Dollar Tree besides when they sell the Little Dawn. And try to find where it's 25% more free, guys. This really works, and it's really, really worth it. So I grabbed two. See, this time I went there, intentions on not going there for a while because I really have to save for this washing machine. So this is a little stupid purchase, but I do send friend mail. This is dimensional stickers, and these are in all the Disney princesses. Look at how cute they are. Look at Milan, Belle, Pocahontas, The Little Mermaid, Mary Ariel. And I love the Cinderella one. No one's getting that. <clears throat> That's my favorite princess. But then, Ariel kicks ass too, so I don't know. I got that. Okay, and then I got... I got these were on my wish list. These are I'm going to put in my bathroom. The only thing is that I wish the, the base was not plastic, but unfortunately it is. These are the unicorn soaps. I found the unicorn -y. Oh, yeah. Found them in green and pink. Okay, so let's see what... Oh, this is purple. So let's see what the purple smells like. Strawberry scented. So let's smell it. Let's smell it. Let's smell the strawberry scented. Oh, yeah. It smells really... It smells okay. It ain't like, oh, God, I gotta go out and buy it. But, yeah, I think they're cute because I really needed them. I still have them Christmas ones in my bathroom. Yeah, that one. And this one smells like, um... They're real watery, like, too, kind of. But I'll refill them. Okay, this one smells like, um, fresh pear. Let's see if it smells like a pear. Let's see if it smells like a pear right in there. Nope, don't smell like a pear at all. It just smells like soap. I'm keep. I'm telling you the truth. It smells like soap. But yeah, I thought they were cute for the bathroom. I mean, I needed soap dispenser, so yeah, that's why I got them. Okay, there goes that bag. Okay, and um, what else do I have her? Um, I did that. Um, okay, I got this, um, this, um, what do you call this, um, little, oh, God, what are these called? Little crayon box. This one, this is a plastic with the pink. You know, I love, I love my pink. So I will put my 64, they don't fit in there now, but my jot, my jots are going in there. And my crayons are going to go in there. Just so I have everything organized. Because I'm working on sketching. And it's currently in my class. So yeah. So I'm excited about that. Alright. And then I got these two. These were beautiful. I love this peach color guys. Look at this. This is a peach basket. It's beautiful. It's gorge. I love this peach color. I can't believe I found it. This was the last one. And then I got two of these. Guys these are big. And this one is going to hold, I don't know what it's going to hold, maybe my mac, my wax melts, I don't know, and my hair pieces, but I think these stack, let me check. No, they don't stack on each other, but they look like they do. Uh, wait, no, they don't, they don't stack on each other. You can even make something like that, seriously. Like, you can be very creative with these, 
These are really pretty. Really, really pretty. I'm so happy to find the color. I mean, and they're nice size, too. They're just calling them baskets. I thought they were really nice. And then, um, what else do I got in here? I got a couple of Easter items and some books. I'll do the books last. I mean, for last. Then I got this big Happy Easter sign. And it's kind of like the love one behind me, but it just says Happy Easter. I love that blue, guys. You know I love that blue. Very 50-ish. That's the color of my kitchen, that blue. I love it, blue and brown. Yeah, so I think I'm going to put this in my kitchen because it's too cute. Got the little flowers. Yeah, I love it. So I am going to put this right here. I got to try to keep things um organized. And then I found um this bunny. And she's so cute. She says spring. Spring is in the air. Yes, it's so cute. And it's like a burlap ribbon, so it kind of like pops out. Ooh, just a little thing. Look at her little face. I hungry, Mom. I hungry. That's my son when he was little. Spring, I love that. It's a glittery. The glitter's getting all over me, but it's so cute with a little polka dot dress. So I had to snag that. And then I got these two signs, which I thought were really, really cute. This one's hippity hoppity Easter's on its way. And these are big eggs. And they got that old farmhouse decor. I love it. Hippity hoppity Easter's on its way. I don't want no bunk ass looking decorations, you know. And this one says everybody welcome. And this is in pink. But honestly, I like the blue better. Because I'm a, I like the, I like blue and pink. So I don't know. This is kind of a toss up. What do you guys think? Blue or pink? So, I don't know. I got these. These are pretty big eggs, guys. And you grab them while you see them because, like the cashier told me, once you see them, you don't get them, they're gone. Because people are like hawks when it comes to the dog food. Like me, if I see something, I grab it. Okay, and lastly, I have some books. Books, 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 books. Shannon don't need no books. All right. Let's see what I got here. They're all books. I got five books. Okay. Let's start with these. I got... Scooby Scooby Doo, where are you? Oh, I love Shaggy. You know what? Something about Shaggy. All right, let me tell you this. I used to smoke weed back in my day. Tell me why. He was high half the time, Shaggy. Toasted. Toasted. All right, anyway, back to the hop. I got the Scooby Doo Jumbo Coloring Book. I've been on the lookout for this. And it's got um just Scooby Doo pictures. There's the gang. And they say that coloring is a good stress buster, so I try to color when I can. So I got these. Look at how cute that is. Look at Shaggy's high ass. Come on now. Toasted, look. Oh yeah, hanging with a dog. Eating all day. It was high as hell. Come on, man. How could they do that to little children? Alright, and then I got this one. This is called Spot the Difference. Test your powers of observation. And they had like four different kinds, but the cupcakes got me because they were super cute. So what you do is, let me see a cute one. All right, this one's pretty cool. You spot the difference on each side. Like what is different? Like does she have a different color hair bow? And that picture is awesome, by the way. Does she have a different color hair bow or is her eyes crossed? And you like check them off. It's really cool. Some stress busting. This one, Keto will love. Keto, I love you, girl. You know, love this. Love it. So, yeah. I like this one. It's going to give me something to do when I'm bored. And then I, got, I did get three books. Okay, the first one is called Press Pause. A journal for self-care, intention, and slowing down. Yes. Now, I'm bipolar, right? I get in that manic phase. Where I'm like, blah, 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 blah. So, I need something that's going to help me slow down. So, let's see one of the techniques. This is really cool. It's a fill-in-the-blank book. I tried to find two for a giveaway, but I couldn't. Okay, one one example is explore writing. And it shows you how to explore different writing techniques. And then it's got like, let me see another one real quick. I think it was, I thought it was cool. Um, celebrate the season. It's like a little journal. You know, and it has questions. I'm going to, I'm, I'm really going to work on this. I'm going to keep this one out because, yeah. And this retail for, um... Come on, I hate when you put these stickers on them. I believe 14 yeah, 14 dollars 14 guys, and I paid a dollar. 
Life moves too fast and press pause. Pause yourself, man. Pause, chill. Have a burr, you know? All right. Then I got this one. This is called the Prayer Wheel. The Prayer Wheel. A daily guide to renewing your faith and a rediscovered spiritual practice. Yes. So I got this. Guys, because I really need to pray more. Because I have a lot of blessings in my life that I want to pray to God about. And every day it has a, not every day, but they have different devotional. Get an easy one. Um, Like the weeks are different. Like stepping into the path. I don't know. I really have to read it. But I thought it was really cool. You know, and it's a hardcover book. So just very devotional descent into hell. And it just, you know, it tells you um, to praise God. You know, and I love the picture on it. It's really pretty. And this book sold for, again, the stupid tape. Let's see. $23, guys, for this little book. $23. Are you kidding me? And the last thing in this long ass haul is this. The Selfie Made, your ultimate guide to social media stardom. Yes, I need this. It looks like that. So, I'm going to flip through. Oh, the pages are black. I love the blue. There we go with the blue. Love the blue. So, let's skip and see what's in here. Uh, oh, it don't look like nothing I'm interested in. Influence Influencers. Um, meme accounts. Um, YouTube, how to do YouTube better, which I need. Um, I don't know, but that's what they look like. They look really cool. This is called, I love it. I think I really found a good one with this one. It says, how do I make it big on social media? What is my story and who is my audience? What content should I post to archive access? How do I go viral or how long does it take to get noticed? This sold for $19.99, guys. I am really going to read this because I want to make my channel pop and by the end of the year. I know it takes time when you are a YouTuber. It's very hard. But, yeah. So, that's the end of this haul. Mm -mm. I don't feel like making people laugh today. I don't feel like being a clown. I miss my daughter and my mom. I ain't even going to lie. But I'm here with my son, and my house is, like, in shambles. Let me turn. Let me turn the camera. Wait, look. Look at that. All in boxes I have to put away. Yeah. So that's pretty bad. Ugh, let's turn you back. Yeah, so. Yeah, so that's that's my story. Yeah, that's, that's what I got to put back. But, um, I just want to say, if you like the content of this channel... Please hit that like button and subscribe and you'll be notified every time I post. And um, I always post something really fun. My next haul is going to be a um, Shop Miss A haul. I promise you I'm going to bring you a Shop Miss A haul. You can check out all the jewelry and everything that I found for a $1, $1, $1. That's like the online dollar store. I love it. I really got to stop shopping. I mean, I have like an addiction. I ain't got the money like that, but... I find the deals, you know, I find the deals and seals, you know, you heard? All right, well, um, I'm going to let y'all go. And remember, if I had a hunter, please, y'all, if you got a channel, pump my name, get me out there so I could get do this giveaway. I told you I'm not on YouTube trying to make money. I'm trying to save y'all money. And I want everybody to see me and know that I'm cool and I keep it real and blah, 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 blah. But yeah, so if you got a channel, please pump me and um, I will pump you in return. I don't even, you don't even have to do all that. But if you want to tell your friends, mommy, go ahead. Yeah, just tell them. But yeah, so that's it for me. I'm done. Now I talked for 25 minutes. Yeah, this haul lasted 25 minutes. And I got to make my Frito bake for my shawty. And I can't stand to see you treated bad. I beat his ass for my shawty. Yeah, so anyway. I got to make some Frito bake for my son. He loves it. And um, I'm going to make some homemade iced tea, I think. Yeah, and a pitcher of, of Kool-Aid. Yeah, iced tea. That sounds good right about now. 
And I'm just going to basically clean up tonight. And it is Saturday. And tomorrow my washing guys going to come because they didn't come yesterday. So, yeah. I'm going to call my friend and see what he's on, see what he's up to. And hopefully we can go on a little date or something. Maybe Mama's going to go on a date. I don't know. But, yeah, tomorrow um, I'm going to start my series sampling Saturday really soon. Where I'm going to sample five to seven products every week. Give you my opinion. Show you what's out there. Show you what's good and what's bad in my opinion. And I'm just trying to work on this channel to make it better. Alright, I don't want to keep rambling on. You will see what comes up next. I got Goose Creek. I got per, per, uh, FragranceNet.com. I got a lot of shit coming in a collective haul. So, God, big girl, breathe. Damn. I know I shouldn't make fun of myself. I act like I'm 500 pounds. But I know I always say big girl. I don't know why. But I do. But I do. And the entire time I want to roll. Alright, well, I'm out. I love y'all. Remember, stay blessed, stay sweet, stay cute, and stay sebe. I love you. Bye, sebes. Mm.